Hi everybody. Now, when you're new to Daisy, a fresh player, you may well find yourself with some meat that you want to cook, and you'll find a stove in a house, or even one of those bigger fireplaces, and you'll come up to it, and you'll open the stove if it's got a door on it, and you'll go, oh brilliant, right, I just need to put my, uh, need to set this stove up to add some fuel to it, add some kindling, but there'll be nothing there. You'll be like, whoa, what's, what's going on? How come I can't turn this stove on? And the answer, once you know, is pretty simple. And that is, you must have something in your hand to start off with that would go onto the stove, whether that be a piece of meat or some kindling or some fuel. So you can see we've now got the place um, tooltip in the middle of the screen. Now remember, that's just tap, not hold. If I hold, I'm going to eat this raw meat. So let's place that in. Now if we look in our vicinity inventory, you'll see... There is the fireplace, complete with, in this case, two smoking racks, a cooking rack, and the places the, for the fuel and the kindling. Now, kindling you obviously need, um, and that can be something like bark from a tree. Um, it can be rags, it could be bandages, it could be paper from a box of ammunition that you have undone. Um, but for, tell you what, let's go and um, let's go and get some fuel from outside, because I do believe. I've got a lighter, yes. So we go out here. Here's a nice tree. Let's scrape some bark. Oh, there's a zombie there. We'll take that. And then we just need some... Let's gather some a long stick. Oh, there's a short stick. Is it going to let us take the long stick? And let's go back inside before that zombie spots us. Was it this house? Or was it that house? Sometimes I forget which houses I go into. I don't think it was this house. No, it wasn't that house. Oh, it was a piggy. Okay, so which house did we come out of? Must have been this house. I know it had a toilet near it. There we go. It was this house. And let's close that door behind us. Now we can go up to the stove. And we can transfer what we got. We had some kindling, so let's put the kindling in there. And then we had a little stick, which we can place there. We can put our knife away. We can take our long stick. And we can split the stick into two. Now we can add these sticks to the fireplace as well. We can take our lighter, we can just go up to the stove and we can look at it. And with a bit of luck, we'll be able to ignite it and then we'll be able to cook our meat. Remember to keep an eye on it, you'll hear it sizzling away. You want to look at it um, either directly if you can see it, in this case, I don't think we can, or wait until it changes color. Don't let it burn. Um, and then you can take it off. Remember, you can start fires, start fireplaces with things like road flares, lighters, matches. You can make a fire drill kit out of a short stick and a piece of bark. Um, and uh, remember, cooking meat and specifically drying meat or smoking meat will make it last much, much longer than keeping it raw where it will probably go off and rot. There we go. Hopefully you found this video useful. Hopefully this will now show you how to access and I guess we could say turn on and use the stoves and fireplaces in daisy as a beginner if you found this video useful hit like if you want to see more of the same press subscribe and i will of course see you again soon